Being the best, probably in no other field, is it more important than in the field of health care. Face it, day in and day out, doctors and nurses are working around the clock to take care of each and every one of us. And for the second year in a row, one area hospital has earned top honors in quality care. In our cover story, Rod Starnes explains what these scores mean and how you can use them to make important health care decisions. Cardiac treatment, emergency room trauma, pediatric care. Travel to any state in just about any city or town, you'll find these and many other basic health care components. But if you're new to an area or you're facing a specific health concern for the first time, it might be difficult to know just which facility offers the highest quality care. In these cases, information is critical. The good news is that information is right at your fingertips. All hospitals in the U.S. are required to submit detailed patient statistics from all specialties, the results of which can be easily accessed through several websites. One of these websites, which is probably the most often visited, is called CMS Compares. And it allows any interested patient to go onto that website, pick the hospital where they think they will be having their surgery or their procedure or even their medical illness addressed, and compare that hospital to other facilities in their service area or in the state or nationally. Comparison shopping. What more can any consumer ask for, especially when shopping for health care? And CMS Compares is a great site. Here, you can find and compare hospitals, download a hospital checklist, and even read up on some patient experiences. That is the patient's perception of care. They actually do make discharge phone calls to Medicare uh, participants, and they ask them about the care that they receive, and they ask questions about their doctor, the facility, the cleanliness, and the, uh, how comfortable the facility is, and they ask about the perception of their stay. Another fantastic site that will assist you in making your health care choices is Health Grades. And here's a feather in the Mid-South health care cap. For the second consecutive year, Baptist Memorial Hospital Memphis has earned the Health Grades Distinguished Hospital for Clinical Excellence Award. Hospitals are deemed to be a center of excellence if they perform within the top 5% of all hospitals nationally. Baptist is a center of excellence in 12 different categories. It's important for patients to know if a hospital is a center of excellence because centers of excellence have been shown, statistically shown, to have 27% lower mortality and 8% fewer complications. Centers of excellence usually perform to um, a very strict set of standards around the services they provide. Uh, they do a lot of them, so practice does make perfect, and generally they're thought to be uh, much safer. Health Grade uses the five-star rating much like you would see for a five-star hotel or a five-star restaurant. When you have achieved five stars, that means that you have achieved a level of excellence in your reported data and in your claims information that exceeds 95% of the other facilities in the nation. So we're very proud of our five-star designations and we're very proud of our centers of excellence here at Baptist. The Health Grade seal of approval was all Vanya Taylor needed. When she first moved to Memphis, her father-in-law experienced a health care crisis. Finding a doctor, let alone a hospital, was challenging. At Baptist, she found just the right care for her loved one. When you move to the city, you don't know nobody. You left all your doctors behind, and they help us so much. And the staff is very good, help us a lot. Any question we have, we have answered fast. In fact, Vanya appreciated her experience at Baptist so much, she's decided to volunteer her services at the hospital. She wants to be a part of the team that really made the grade when she needed them most. And Vanya is not alone in benefiting from these thorough and invaluable online guides. Many patients are now taking charge of determining their treatment options. Informed patients for inspired health care. And this lets them be empowered. This lets them be a part of the planning and the treatment team and makes them be a part of facilitating the outcome. And I think it relieves stress and anxiety for a lot of, of our patients to know that they've done their best to research and make an intelligent, informed decision. For Smart Medicine, I'm Rod Starnes. Joining us now is the chairman of the board of the Germantown Chamber of Commerce, Amy Berenger. And Amy, welcome to Smart Medicine. Thank you. It's a delight to have you here. We're going to talk today about health care rating sites and why is it so important business leaders understand these healthcare rating sites? 
Well, really, a lot of times health care benefits can represent one of the largest expense items on a business's income statement. Uh, when that's the case, a business wants to be sure that they're getting value for their investment. You know, by avoiding high cost, low quality providers, um, businesses and, and health plans that access rating sites can often um, not only help improve the quality of their employees, but also rein in their health care costs. Achieve a lot of efficiencies across the board right there. That's right. Why, why are more businesses starting to look at these sites? You know, I, I think some businesses are starting to look at the sites, but, but maybe more importantly than the business, their health plan administrators are certainly looking at these sites. Um, a lot of the health plans are the people that brought this to light in the first place. They're the ones that requested that this information come out to the public domain. Um, they want ways to compare and assure that they're getting value and quality for their health care investment. So it's really good shopping is what's happening here. That's right. And, and what type of information are they trying to find? Where are they drilling down to? Right. Um, they want to know that they're getting a value for their investment, um, some bang for their buck, so to speak. Um, they want to know, they want to be able to compare healthcare organizations, uh, and these sites allow them to do that. Um, some sites allow you to compare to national averages, um, while other sites allow you to compare to competitors within the same local service area. And how is this information affecting their decisions about health benefits for their employees? You know, I, I think, again, it's probably as much driven by their plan providers um, making decisions about who's providing the best quality, um, who's going to give them the best outcomes for their health care dollar, uh, and then they're driving that back down through the business leaders. All right. Amy, thanks so much for joining us. To learn more about hospital grading, head on over to WKNO.org and click on the Smart Medicine icon or check out smartmedicine.tv.